Hey beautiful birds, welcome to Joy with Jazita and today we are just going to learn conditional, okay? What is a conditional in English and in Spanish, okay? So let's begin without wasting any time and we are going to learn about the verb querer, okay? That is to want. So let's start. Okay, first I will tell you in English and alongside i will tell you in spanish okay so here i would want okay i would want in a sentence is queria queria okay it is yo queria okay yo queria hmm? you would want you would want is it is you would want to querías querías okay the pronoun here for spanish is tu okay and then he she they okay he she they would want would say with me would it's not would no no l no it's would pronounce it as habla so would okay he she they okay would want is queria okay queria hmm? and the pronoun here for spanish is el ellas okay el ellas he she they okay and usted okay queria okay queria would want and usted now we will go to we would want okay we would want and let me tell you it's same in english but it's different in spanish okay so spanish is tricking you out here so don't worry it's very easy okay you just have to do i will you just have to do the queria you know just remember this ria thing when you are trying to say the conditional okay and slowly slowly you will remember it okay i'm not explaining all the tricks in here but to remember this i will tell you at the end of the video and uh, as i said in the last video about kisiste see you want to kiss so querer wanting to kiss you won't forget that querer has the past tense called kiss you know in the verb querer the preterit tense is kiss kiso kisis desi so yeah so now let's go to we would want hmm? we would want we would want is queríamos see okay divide this into three parts and then you will be able to pronounce it nicely so queríamos okay queríamos and here it is nosotros nosotros queríamos Okay, we would want. Hmm? The next is queria is. Queria is is you would want. And querían is they would want. Okay, and here again is tú. And here is ellos and ustedes. Okay, so now we have querría, querría es. Queria, queríamos, queríais, querían. Now we'll go to the examples for you to understand it better. I would want, I would want that pen. I would, okay, you remember this expression first. I would want, okay, then you remember this. What do you want? What do you want? Okay. Que tu quieres? So I would want is yo quería ese. That is basically ese, but you have to. I would want is yo quer, yo quería, yo quería querer, quería. Okay. Okay. And the in conditional, you have to remember that these. Two are, these two are come together. Okay, 
to form the conditioner okay join the both letters both the r's and do the rumba okay then you will never forget it okay <laughs> that's a silly trick but yeah it will help you remember and that will go really a long way because in spanish the verbs are endless and the tricks are endless in english it's the same but in spanish it's not mostly is the same right okay so coming back to here is yo quería ese bolígrafo 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 i would want that pen okay i would want that that pen okay and then next example is Gabriela would want to dance at the party so how would you say that Gabriela Gabriela would want okay Gabriela quería okay Gabriela quería would want okay Quería bailar en la fiesta. Simple. Party. Part, party. 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 Party is fiesta. Okay. And here are the joiners of the sentence which we will learn more about in coming videos. So, in the party. Okay. Cool enough. Close enough. So, the main gist of the sentence is that you have to remember is Gabriela quería bailar en la fiesta. Gabriela want, want, would want to dance at the party. And yo quería ese bolígrafo. I would want that pen. Okay. And in the querer, bring both the R's together and do the rumba. Simple. So, I hope you like this video and looking forward, looking forward to have more fun, okay? Thank you for watching. Please do like, comment, share and subscribe.